myself here just a second. Um, I don't have a lot of time this morning. I'm getting ready to go to the doctor, and I will, guys, I will give you an update about what's going on when I get back. Um, so today we're going to do our, um, wow, Liz, think. It's our luxury scent boxes. And these are the ones from November because there was a little confusion because we ended up getting the November and then a December, like right away. So, December. Oh my gosh, this is December. We got a January right away. So I had to, like, figure all that out. So let's go ahead and get in here. Um, luxury scent box is $17 a month. If you want the canister every month. Um, otherwise, if you just want to get the scent, it is $15 a month. And this is Pink Sugar Sensual. Oh, that smells really good. Really good. I like that. Okay, and then we got a little um, thing at the... Mark Jacobs Decansons, which I got in one of my boxes, and I, I love, I love. Okay, so this is what you get in the box. You can also get this little sachet sometimes, sometimes you don't. Sometimes you get it in a little box. So I always get that. I do believe that this is mine and not mom's, but let's go ahead and open up the other one, and then we'll be for sure. I know these videos are short, and there's not a lot to them, but I really do enjoy getting the luxury scent box. Um, both of these came with the little sachet. The little sample was Prada Milano. So that's the little sample that came in it. Prada Milano. I don't think I've tried that one yet. Prada Milano. I don't think so. And this one is Omenia. Paraiba. I'll hold it up so hopefully you guys can see it and if I'm reading it wrong you can let me know because I'm not a hundred my face all the way focus focus um I'm not a hundred percent sure on that one but this is definitely my mom's very very floral I like mine sweeter um I don't like the, the a lot of floral. I don't know why my camera is way up in the air today. Okay, but that was mom's box. So, I'm, I'm getting ready to go to the doctor, so I don't want to have like a hundred cents on me. So what should we do? I want to spray this and I want to smell it for you guys. I wish they came with a, like a little card that explained the scent that you get, but they don't. Um. Yeah, this is just, this is just a little card that says, tells you some of the scents that you can get. Oh, that is very floral. I don't know what flower that is, but it is very floral. Whew. That's a strong one. Cats love these little things. I gotta keep the little things away from my cats. You guys noticed my Jeremiah photobombing me constantly? And if this one smells good, this is what I'm going to wear today. Get the different, the other card here. Oh, that is good. It's got... Like this, the pink sugar smell to it, but then it has undertones of, like... A musk or just a really nice fragrance I like that that's probably what I'm gonna wear to the doctor this morning I have to be there at 1020 and it's not quite nine o'clock so I have enough time why don't we go ahead and we'll do the morphe me while we're here which I have over here my desk is such a freaking mess right now because I got up did my hair did my makeup all that stuff this morning okay morphe me 1995 a month um, I don't know what's going on with the Morphe's saying that they're trying to, or Live Glam, sorry. Live Glam is saying that they're trying to get 
all the issues with the credit card problems fixed. So I don't know what the, what's going on with that. But that's my Morphe Me, and I think I held it up backwards for you a minute ago. Um, Morphe Me is you get. Um, I, I get, our, yeah, the Morphe Me from the Live Glam. I got three brushes this time. Yeah, and the, whoo, stop and take a breath. Whew, okay, sorry about that. Um, the Morphe Me subscription, you get Morphe brushes, and they're supposed to total $30 in value. Um, I'm looking at these. I'm trying to find information on the card about these. You should get this nice little card. And it tells you about each brush. And what it suggests you use it for. Even though, as I tell you every time with these brushes, you use them for whatever you want to use them for. Um, so, okay. Let's... It doesn't say much about the brushes other than you know they're suggested okay let's go ahead and get started in here we're going to start with the g5 which looks like it's this one right here yes it is you take it out of its little package i love my getting my morphe brushes um i've been with morphe for quite a while now and i am really building up a nice collection of brushes and i love them just soft nothing that you wouldn't expect from morphe um i do notice that this brush in particular, I'm just going to see if I can find one. Sorry, I'm in your way. That's kind of similar to size. This one is really light. This one, I guess they're about the, they're about the same. They're about the same. Just, I think I've had other Morphe brushes that are heavier. But these are about the same. And I do believe these are from their gunmetal collection, which is why that's a G5. Um, so the G5, let's see what it says. It says, set your base with this. And it's a pointed powder brush, actually. A uh, pointed powder brush. Its tapered point allows for perfect powder application. You can also apply your blush and bronzer with these plush bristles, giving you a fresh face look all throughout 2018. Okay, so that's G5, and it's the Gunmetal Collection, which I kind of like. Um, in January, we got the red... The red ones on oh home. Gosh, those are so beautiful. I haven't used them yet. They are so beautiful. They're just like the uh, gunmetal, except they're in the red. And oh my gosh, how beautiful! And these are gonna look good up there with them. Okay, then G39. Is that this one? No, that is this one. Okay, G39. It says, to get that flawless look for your NYE party, New Year's Eve party, Mom. start with this deluxe foundation brush. It's dual fiber bristles will give you an airbrushed finish that will look like, look as smooth as the year ahead. Okay, this is not one that I would consider a foundation brush because it's just really, I think it's too soft. I mean, it might, I don't know. I might have to play with that one and find out. Oh, it's dented. Oh, well. It's got a little dent. Not a big deal. But that's the uh, G39. And did I hold this one up so you can see it? The G G5. Okay, that's the G5. And then our last brush is the G42. Okay, it's a flat contour, contour brush, which that's exactly what I would have thought of it for. Um, these have little dents in them all over. Hmm. That's the G42. Effortlessly define your features with this thin flat top contour brush and look like a brand new you. These soft, 
yet firm bristles will help you stay snatched all year with this precise contour snatched all right so those are the three brushes we got this month um excited to see what they're going to do for february um so i love getting my morphe brushes i absolutely am before my morphe brushes all i had was elf brushes and was it wet and wild from the dollar tree so then when i started getting the morphe brushes it's like there's such a difference i don't dislike the elf or the wet and wild brushes i think they're great brushes um but there, i have gotten such a variety of brushes through morphe that i would have not gotten that i you don't find um around with your wet and wild and your and your elf so it's really nice to have a variety and that is my video for today i hope you guys enjoyed it Please like, subscribe, comment below, and we will see you in the next video. All right, guys, you have a great day, and um, I will give you an update on what the doctor says. Love you all. Bye!